from the Lakeside Newsroom of the Henrico Citizen, your hometown news source since 2001. This is the Henrico News Minute with publisher Tom Lapis. A Henrico man facing 30 charges in connection to a series of thefts and how students at one Henrico school have been helping their peers who suffer from mental illness for 20 years now. We'll tell you about that and more in today's Henrico News Minute. It's Thursday, April 13th, 2023, and it's brought to you today by Henrico County. And now for the news. A 23-year-old Henrico man is facing 30 charges related to crimes committed in early March at Washington Memorial Park in Sandston. Austin Curtis Robertson faces eight counts of grand larceny, three counts of petty larceny, eight counts of possessing stolen property with the intent to sell, and 11 counts of injuring a church or cemetery. In early March, park administrators reported that hundreds of items had been stolen from the cemetery, resulting in several thousand dollars in losses. Police identified Robertson as a suspect with assistance from the public. He's currently being held at Riverside Regional Jail on unrelated charges from Charles City County. Henrico County employees recently donated more than $25,000 to Children's Hospital of Richmond at VCU. County officials formally made the donation of $25,144 to hospital officials recently. They came through a cause marketing program called Benefits That Benefit Children through Pierce Insurance and National Benefit Partners that provides donations to children's charities throughout the country. The funds were generated through the program in conjunction with a voluntary employee benefits effort provided by Chubb, Legalese, Norton LifeLock, National Benefit Partners, and Pierce Insurance. 20 students from the Collegiate School in Henrico traveled to the campus of Jackson Field Behavioral Health Services in Jarrett April 1st to transform the organization's recreation center into a boutique filled with racks of formal dresses and tables with shoes, jewelry, and makeup. It was all part of the Fairy Godmother program, which collegiate students have been running at Jackson Field for 20 years now. Through it, students paired up with residents of Jackson Field to help them find ensembles that made them feel special. Jackson Field is a residential psychiatric treatment program that serves children 11 through 18 who suffer from severe mental illness. The students will participate in a spring dance on campus. In the 20 years of the program, officials estimate that more than 700 prom dresses have been given to residents. Three Henrico homes sold for more than a million dollars recently. You can find out where they were and how much they went for in our weekly property transactions report. Find that right now on our website, HenricoCitizen.com. And each week we give you a rundown of some of the animals available for adoption at the Henrico Animal Shelter. We've got 22 of them featured right now in our weekly fur finder segment on HenricoCitizen.com. Take a look. We've got pictures of the dogs and cats that are available. Make your way over to the animal shelter if you see one that you like. They may not stick around for long. And we're in the midst of our spring membership drive right now. Your support helps fund all the work that we do. There's a lot more that we wish we could do, but we don't have the resources or staff members to do it all. And that's where you come in. If you would like to help, you can make a contribution of any amount right now at our website, EnricoCitizen.com. Look in the upper right-hand corner for a yellow button that says Support the Citizen. We'd love it if you signed up for a recurring monthly contribution. If you give $75 or $150 a year, you'll become an automatic member of our Citizen Collective Membership Program, which comes with benefits. And we sure do appreciate your support. Today's Henrico News Minute has been brought to you by Henrico County. Henrico County is now hiring. You can visit henrico.us backslash jobs to view a complete list of all opportunities, full and part-time, that are currently available. To learn more about Henrico's commitment to its employees in the Henrico way and find out why employees like Henrico Police Logistics Asset Manager Kristen Gaines say, quote, Henrico feels like my home. It really is my family. I can't imagine doing anything else. That's henrico.us backslash jobs.